Hello dear gamers, York Phil here and today we are back for the episode 11 or 11 of Tokyo School Raifu. So in the previous episode, I think I went on a date with Sakura-chan um, at Akihabara. I think that's the name of the world uh, we went to. Uh, so yeah, some weird things happened. I'm not gonna tell you if you wanna know them, just watch the previous episode and then come back here. But now let's move on and get into the episode 11 of Tokyo Skuru Daifu. Hey, Yorkfield, wake up, wake up, it's morning. Oh, good morning. It's the first week of exams at Keiakidai Kea High. These are the final exams before summer vacation. They have a huge impact on our grades. Starting one week before the exams begin, all after-school clubs are cancelled so students can dedicate their time to studying. So the Karate Do Club has off this week too. When I have the Karate Do Club, I wake up every morning at 5 a.m. But for now, I can make it to school if I wake up by 7 a.m. It's been a while since I had such a nice restful morning. Good more, Karin. <laughs> Good morning? What's the expression for? Go wash your face. <laughs> Go wash your face. Um, I slept too much. Now I'm sleepy. What a lazy bum. <laughs> watch, watch me and learn how to get your act together. Yeah, yeah? <laughs> I can't like how she said Ohio <laughs> This is the second time I'm laughing at Sakura saying Ohio Gozaimas. And also Hunter by the way uploaded a video of me laughing at Sakura saying Ohio And this is the second time <laughs> Morning, Sakura. Yorkfield-san, when I see Aoi-san come and wake you up in the morning, it reminds me of something. Yeah, maybe. What is it? It's on the tip of my tongue I got it it's the childhood friend who lives next door and always comes to make up the main character that's it I feel relieved <laughs> what are you guys even talking about Okay, eat some breakfast, and it's off to school with you. Do your best. Okay, it's starting pretty well. I did laugh quite a bit. Who knows what will happen. At school, each day has exams for two or three subjects. Since the tests have a direct impact on your grade, everyone's serious about them. As for me, no matter what score I get, it won't have any effect on my grades at my high school in my country, so in a way, I'm very at ease. Still, I don't intend to slack off either. But for the same reasons, I struggle with my daily classwork. The exams are very difficult for me. Even if the subjects are the same, the scope of material covered can be different from my country. On top of that, all the questions on the test are full of kanji. When you get to high school level exams, the Japanese used on the test is pretty hard on its own. First, I have to translate the question from Japanese, then solve it, then translate my ba answer back into Japanese. The whole process takes up a lot of brain power. It wraps up around noon, so you can go right home as soon as you're done. The first thing I do when I arrive home is eat lunch. Today, at Karin's request, I will made seafood with fried rice. The springy shrimp are so yummy. 
After eating, we all studied together. After casually comparing the answers from today's exam, we're going to prepare for tomorrow's exam. Today, we're going over our answer for the English exam. I just realized something amazing, you guys. What is it, Karin-san? We're going to compare the answers we gave on today's test, right? But the results already set in stone. So what on earth is the point here? My fucking god! Oh. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to laugh at this so hard. Karin-chan, that's not a good way of thinking. Whoa. And English too. Like we live in Japan. It's not like we have to speak English. Karin-chan, here, have something sweet and get your energy back. Want some cake? Oh, do you want some cake? Hey, Sakura-chan, but what really is the point of comparing answers? The faster you review, the better. If you review immediately after the exam, the knowledge will be established from more firmly in your memory. Huh? Hey, Sakura, isn't the answer wrong for English question 3B? Yeah, it's no, this should be correct. See? Look, this question follows the same model as this one in the textbook. No way! No one actually speaks formally like this. Even so, the tests are made based around the content of the textbooks. That's ir irrational. Out of the three of them, Sakura is the best student with the highest grades. It seems like she's good in pretty much every subject. So, because of the earth condition, she often has to sit in our gym class. So that's the only class she gets mediocre grades in. Next, we prepare for the math test tomorrow. Sakura-chan, Sakura-chan! Sakura-chan, Sakura-chan, how did you resolve this problem? First, you convert the equation like this. With all the parts you've sold so far, you can apply this formula. Whoa, this is like magic. This is high school math, so unlike college math, it's essentially just combining the formulas written in the textbook. Hmm, but I couldn't come up with this way of combining them. You should think of it like a puzzle. Use the patterns of combinations of the formulas to solve the problems and comment them to memory. I see. Like a puzzle, huh? I think I can handle that. I'll give it a shot. I always pretty well rounded at doing decent in all subjects. She's a bit skillful in the liberal arts like history and Japanese language, but she doesn't care for math or science so much. 
Couldn't you solve this problem by doing this and then this? <laughs> I've never seen that symbol. わあ。あおいさんを混乱させないでください。それは3年生の学習範囲です。私たちはまだ習っておりません。you will feel sun. Please don't confuse Ayoi san. That's part of third year students' curriculum. We haven't been taught this yet. Oh, I see. This will have something. It is easier though. <laughs> I'm a bit gifted when it comes to math. For math, I don't have any language comprehension issues either. I'm gonna build up my points here. By the way, if you solve it that way, I suspect it may be marked as incorrect. That's irrational. Again, I just realized something amazing, you guys. What's the matter, Karin-chan? Are we even gonna ever use the map after this? Uh, all we usually use when buying stuff is like addition or subtraction, right? Is there any point to learning these formulas? Karin-chan is getting corrupted, for sure. I don't care, I'm gonna become a worldwide top artist. <laughs> maybe she's gonna become like Miku, Miku Atsune or Aikizuna, maybe. Yes, Karin-san, you're fine as you are. Right, right? Still, I admit, I have my doubts. Sakura-chan, what use will math have for us in the future? Yes, well, for example, for Karin-san, let's say she goes on a tour overseas. What? Me? For example, it's likely that you may miss your connecting flights and have to take a rental car to your destination. Oh yeah, I heard a story like that from one of the higher ups who went through it. She said she was really stressed. <clears throat> you have to calculate the remaining distance to your destination and figure out if you can make it. Do you think you could remain calm and calculate that? Ah, naruhodo! Tashkani ne! So kangaru to kesan dekiru ni kosta koto wa nai ne! Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. When you think about it that way, you have to do calculations. Well, I think normally the staff will do it for you, so Karin, you're fine as you are. Oh, I got it. I'll keep trying a bit more. Okay, I'm gonna make some chocolate milk from, for everyone. Sugar is important to keep your brain moving.
And so, the exams that had seemed like they would never end finally draw to a close. It's over! I stretch wildly. Yes! I'm free! Yeah, it's finally over. Good work, everyone. Oh, Karin peaked! <laughs> she peaked! What the hell? Whoa, Karin-chan, something's coming out of your mouth. I think your soul is trying to fly away? Hmm, I thought this for a while, but isn't having people with different grades take the same curriculum kind of inefficient? Hmm, it's a difficult issue. You should. You could also say that if you gather people with different strengths, they can help motivate each other. Yeah, you could think of that way too, couldn't you? I don't know about all that stuff, but I'm happy I'm the same class as Karin-chan and Sakura-chan. Yes, exactly. Oh, hey, and me? You're gonna leave me out? Oh, of course you too, you old pills. Okay, thanks a lot, Ayui. I'm just an afterthought, aren't I? The end? Huh? It's the end of talking about studying. It is time for a fun summer vacation. Who cares about that stuff anymore? Yeah, Kirai Kirai Haya now has a long break for over a month. Japanese summer is on its way. Hi, Karin san. Yes, Karin san. Let's enjoy ourselves to the fullest. But, but I will try a little bit harder at studying and reviewing. I'm so excited excited for summer. What are your plans for summer break? The Karate Do Club will practice regularly through the summer break. Os, Shishu, Os. Very interesting group. Next month, there's a summer matsuri or festival at Tomoe Shrine. There will be many food carts and fireworks will be set off. It should be quite splendid. Wow, I can't wait. Karin loves swimming for sure. I want to go swimming when I have a day off. If not at the beach, then at least at the pool. I want to swim till I pass out. Sounds like the time has come to show off my swimming skills. I'm looking forward to the summer break. Seems like there's gonna be a lot of fun stuff going on. But most of all, I can't wait for the school trip. Kiyakadai High second year students have a field trip during their summer break. We can choose from some famous tourist spots all around Japan. Everybody is deciding where to go with their friends. Yo, Yorkville. Let's talk about where we can, where to go on the field trip. Huh? The guy I've gotten to know the best is Maru Yamakun, who sits next to me. Oh, Yorkville. You're going with ya Maru Yamakun group, huh? If we go to the same place, maybe we'll see you there. <laughs> I don't want to have to look at his goofy face. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> So Karin thinks I'm ugly? <laughs> I can't fucking believe this. No, um, I... Come on, let's go, you're a pill. Maruyama drags me to the usual group of guys. 
Ah, nothing but guys. What a pitiful lineup. Well, not like any of us are ladies' men that can go on a field trip with a girl. Yeah, I guess not. Yorkfield, did you say something? Oh, no, nothing! Ururaito! Then let's get to planning this trip. Okay. Gonna be traveling Japan, I think, guys. The summer vacation passes in no time flat. Since I joined Maruyama's field trip group, we start to spend a lot more time together than usual during the summer vacation. We go to the arcade, play soccer, hang out at the musical instrument shop, and have fun with all the usual pastimes for guys on summer vacation. We we'll finish things off with the field trip to Hokkaido. Hokkaido is so vast, and the dairy products and seafood are so delicious I could cry. It, it has quite cool weather. So it was a bit refreshing after all the heat in Tokyo. Then, the day I must return to my country approaches. Wait, already? See ya, Yorkfield. Email me. You too, Mariyama. Don't forget to reply. Everyone at Tomoe Domushri has some business to attend to and, I, and can't show me off at the airport. Mariyama is really a great guy to have come despite being busy. Goodbye, Japan. And thank you. Wait, it's the end already? And so, my short study abroad comes to an end. Due to various circumstances, things ended up like a little anticlimactic, but these two months have been memorable enough to make up for that. Wait, you wanna know what I'd do if I'd had a chance to do it all over? Well, of course, I'd make sure to not have any regrets this time, because I still haven't reached my first goal of coming to Japan to get to know a cute girl, that one. Holy shit! It's the end? Already? Holy crap! We ended this game with 11 episodes just like Doki Doki Lurch Club! Holy shit! I just realized that! Oh my god, this game was so awesome! I thought there was like more things going on, you know? Oh my god. Oh my goodness. I'm speechless about this. <sighs> yeah, because this game was like very awesome. I mean, I want to cry right now, but I can't. I thought this episode was gonna be like longer. It's only been 24 minutes since I'm now recording this. Holy crap. Holy crap. That was an awesome game. Like, it was extremely good. I loved it. Congratulations to M2 for developing this. That was just an awesome game. I don't know what else to say about this. Oh, we return to the main menu. Let me see the extra, see if there's any. Gallery. Ah, yes, all of that. All the uh, uh, moments we had, uh, like from the beginning to the end. Like when I messed up with Karin, spilt in on Aoi, went to the library with Sakura and all those. What is... Oh, that's all the soundtracks in the game. Wow, that's so cool. So, okay, we have unlocked, I think, the, the, the soundtrack um, for the game, which is so awesome. Okay, I think there's nothing for us to see. Let me just look at the options. Oh, I could have set the sub window to Japanese or hiragana or maybe even romaji. So I think it would, like, show up on the top since, you know, the... Uh, the main window is like on the bottom, so yeah, maybe I could have, you know, enabled hiragana like that, since you know, I'm studying Japanese with hiragana 
and very little kanji. Uh, okay. Uh, we could have turned off the voices. Quick save. Okay. Okay. So I think that marks the end of Tokyo Scooter Daifu. Alright, guys. Thank you very much for watching this playthrough of Tokyo Scooter Daifu. Not gonna lie. I expected this game to be like much longer since you know I did I did watch some YouTube uh, walkthrough a little bit not too much because I didn't want to spoil myself but yeah it ended up much earlier than I thought it ended up in 11 episodes just like Doki Doki Literature Club so maybe I'll make a post or to say like um Tokyo School Life or Doki Doki Literature Club or maybe Doki Doki Literature Club Plus as well since I got the Plus version recently and I might make also a short um, saying which one do I prefer or do I like both games so yeah that marks the end of Tokyo Skudu Daifu we should be back in like another game or another video like reaction meme or whatever so thank you very much for watching Mite kurete arigato we will see you in the next one. Stay safe, take care, and remember, life is a game with many games to choose from. Peace, bye!